striking distance. Kevin goes joker. Fox is having a day, Kevin Ambrick. Ambrick's fighting for his chance as he flies the jump big and long. Kevin Hansen gonna try and shut the door on Timmy. Cogs out between the brothers. Kevin in front of Timmy. Timmy will look up the inside over the crest. The number 21 passes his brother. Kevin inside on the way into Velodrome. They're side by side. Smokes the tires up. Kevin's back underneath him again. Timmy Hansen follows him down the hill. Unbelievable stuff. There is no team tactics here, is there? They're letting the brothers fight, and that's what we want to see. The two top two in the championship are going head to head, and they're not giving each other any room. Absolutely brilliant stuff. Timmy trying to find tracks to go alongside Kevin again. You ride on board now with Timmy Hansen. He led the standings by a point coming here. Kevin took that back off and leaves by a point now. Abrick's got Joker if they held each other up too much. Kevin Abrick going to try and split the two per shows. Where's he slot in? Side of Timmy Hansen. Kevin Abrick. Fantastic job by ES Motorsport. They saw the battle going on behind and they knew they had to get him in whilst he had the time to do it. Absolutely brilliant. Kevin Hansen here putting himself in a position to maybe go through to the front. He qualified third, so if Ericsson wins his semi, then Kevin will be on the outside. Timmy gives Abring a nudge. Two nudges. He's going to trouble for that before. Then I got the inside of Kevin Abring. Abring going to try and hold on for third. What do you think about that, Dan? I think that's definitely a bit of a risky move there. The push on the way in and then halfway around the corner again. Back a bit here, maybe Timmy's getting the red mist. Stewart's have been harsh here. Timmy Hansen could be looking at a penalty. If they give him five seconds, he might drop out, but they may just switch the positions back. At the minute, though, it's Kevin Hansen who is out front and untroubled. Kevin Ambring pressuring Kevin's older brother Timmy. Here comes the younger Hansen now, the yellow squad down to the bottom of the hill through the right hand, and Timmy's chasing him. Contentious move on Ambring, but Kevin Hansen comes around the last corner. Brilliant fight with his brother. Great to see the fight. It's Kevin Hansen who wins semi one from his brother Timmy and Kevin Ambring P3. The crowd liked that. I loved it. God, that was fantastic. First semi final. There's the contact. But Kevin Hansen had about three different bits of contact on the run to turn one. Timmy went joker straight away. Mark and with those guys had planned that early, Dan. Yeah, so they, they set themselves up on the way out of turn one. They knew they had cars on their inside, so it's better to just break a bit later and go for the joker lap and, and not lose any time trying to go standard. That group was pretty sideways here, but at, at this point, we didn't necessarily think he was slow. But by now, we can see is you're on board with Timmy. He will have seen Andreas run wide there, and he'll know what's going on ahead of him. I don't know when Kevin Ambrin got past. So that was where Timmy got held up, and that actually was what gave Kevin the gap to be more comfortable. Yeah, so Kevin then took advantage and, and uh, went for the joker lap, but uh, it was only just enough. They came out side by side. We ride on board with Timmy, I believe, for the merge here. Look so at this, Kevin on the right, into the door, <laughs> have some of that. He then knows he's going to go inside, but Kevin's lit it up over the crest. Going to go inside again on the way into Velodrome. Here it is from the outside. Look at this. Absolutely no quarter given. That is what we want to see. Yeah, Kenneth has said there's no racing orders. We're going to let them fight. That's how you do no team orders, other motorsport. That's how you do no team orders. This is Kevin Abring, and I have to say, brilliant lap by him. We saw him fly the jump hard, and then he says, get in there, up the inside. You know, gives Timmy Hansen the sort of treatment we'd expect from a rallycross pro. He's done his second event at world championship level. Yeah, he's not quite used to the rough and tumble, but he's getting stuck in. Brilliant, brilliant job by Kevin Abring. Hansen did get past him. We wonder if there'll be an investigation, but Kevin Hansen took the win.